Hi everyone, today I'm gonna to show you how to reset Microsoft Edge to default. There's no default option, so you've gotta sort of go directly to the path where it's installed and delete all the files. So let me just copy out the path. So if we open up a folder, in fact, before I do that, let me just open up Edge. As you can see, I've set it to just a Facebook page and that's the default page it opens every single time. So if I shut it down, if I open it back up again, that's the default page it's gonna to go to. Now the reason I'm gonna show you this is because today um, I got an email and it infected Edge and it came up with this warning. So if you see this, you get a constant beep and no matter what you do, you can get rid of it. So the only way to clear it completely without having to go to a shop and pay to have it done is the reset edge. So if I open up a folder and I go to this location, I will put links in the, in the description. So if I go here and press enter, you have to delete all these folders. This will stop edge from working completely, but I'll show you how to resolve that now. When you select all and delete, you might find it won't delete everything. So if we click, can click cancel, go in, go into a folder and just try and delete them one by one. So now we've gone in, that will delete. Let's go into Edge. Let's have a look, see if we can delete these ones. Yep, so they're gone. Bit of a painstaking process, but if we go in here, so that should be able to go now. Go into here and delete. Go back out, delete and delete that again. So great, that'll go. Let's see what else we can delete. Oh, right, so it's stuck on those ones. If we go in, try and delete all these. Yep, yeah, so there's the one it's stuck on. So let's go straight in, go back in again. It's a bit annoying having to go in and out of all the folders, but uh, it doesn't take long as you can see. So let me just delete that and delete that and hopefully delete that. Yeah, that's fine. Now let's go in here again, same thing. Delete, continue. Yep, stuck on one, so let's go in. Same one again. Delete. We can delete that. Let's see if we can delete this one. Yep, that's gone. Let's have a try. Yep. So if we go up, delete. Yep. So that's the original URL we went to. I will put this in the description, like like I said. So if we close that down now and open up Edge, nothing. Don't work at all. Right. Okay. So there's a PowerShell script you have to run. So if you do a search for PowerShell. There it is. Right click with the right mouse button and run as administrator. You'll get a pop up. Just click yes. And now you'll see this blue screen. So you've already copied the script you'll need. So just right click and paste. There's the script and press enter. This will go through reset edge. That's fine. And if we open up edge now, it's working again. Brand new as if it's just come out the box. So you can set all your options and your problem is resolved. Hope you enjoyed the vid. Don't forget to like and, and subscribe. Thanks very much.